we grew up in Lexington. Um, my parents went to UK, my sister went to UK, and we really did not make the uh, decision kind of as a group. I mean, we're very individual people, uh, even though we are triplets. So we were actually raised UK fans, like, um, and it was kind of an unwritten thing that we'd all be, we'd all go to UK and we'd, um, we'd go study there. But it was just a thing. We were like, oh, UK is a great school. Like, we're thankful that UK is so great. Um, and we all decided to go there. There are actually four of us. Um, his name is Jadullah Amran. Um, and he is currently at BCTC. Um, he's pre-nursing and he'll transfer after his sophomore year to UK with us. Uh, UK was, was in every way the best option for all of us. So I think independently, we all just kind of each ended up here. We are all in the honors program. So we're all in the central dorms. But yeah, me and Cameron are across the hall from each other. Yeah. And Ben is actually in the exact same room as Cameron in Central too. So like he's 447, Ben's 447, and I'm 446. I don't really know how that happened, but. Yeah. <laughs> in high school, people always grouped us together. We were always, you know, the quads. It's just been really nice to, um, to come to college and like people not really know you and you get to know um, other people and not necessarily have the same friends. Cause like in high school, we all, yeah. always had the same group of friends hanging around and we were all just friends, but it, it's nice to be like, I don't know, have that sense of individuality. Individuality, like I'm me and I'm not the quads, but I'm me, Nasreen, and not, you know, with them, with them. Even though I love them, don't get me <laughs> wrong, but it's just really nice to be your own, your own person. With me and my brothers, I think we've been able to branch out more and hang out with different groups of people than in high school. And I think that's really important for personal growth as well as honestly just getting closer with your brothers. Because when you're not around them all the time, when you're not kind of forced to because of this kind of same central friend group, you tend to appreciate the qualities they have more. So I think that that has been a really positive experience for all three of us. Yeah, I'm the oldest by 30 seconds. She <laughs> never lets seconds. us forget it. Yeah, like well, she's the time. smart one, so we usually we usually mooch off of her. Uh, so it's good to have classes with her. You have one person to like check the other two people if you know they decide they don't want to go to class, or um, I'll, I might ask Sadie every once in a while, "Oh, did you get that web assigned homework done?" Or do you need help with it? And vice versa. Like we help each other out, which is really nice. Do we still have sort of that support network of family? You know, I. As, as often as we fight and <clears throat> don't get along, we're all still brothers. And it's nice to always have that safety net and you know someone who you know will always be supportive and there for you. Um, in another sense though, it's, it's kind of cool because we all do sort of do our own thing on campus and you get to meet a lot more people that way. Uh, we took Spanish in high school and well, we've been taking Spanish for eight years. And so we're almost fluent and I've always wanted to go um, overseas and I don't know, study in Spain or Mexico or Ecuador. I've always wanted to participate in um, some type of research, um, just kind of like on the side to get that experience. <laughs> I don't know, both those things sound great, but Dance Blue, like we could make our own team. <laughs> I know all three of us are looking to be a part of Dance Blue. So that's something that the three of us are going to be doing, um, hopefully on the floor uh, by the time that comes around. So that's one thing that the three of us are doing. I'm also involved in uh, student government. Um, I'm on Senate uh, here. Uh, and so that's, that's really cool. I've gotten to meet a lot of awesome people. Not, not to mention his brothers were a huge part of him getting that. We, I don't, how many hours do you think we put in for him over the election days, Cameron? I don't know. Did a lot of campaigning <laughs> for Ben. I'd yeah. say I probably put in around 15 hours, something like that. I think you're a lot more likely to vote for someone if someone that is their brother is like approaching them. It seems more personal. I don't know. We were out there, hey, vote for Ben, that sort of thing. Texting yeah, yeah the that, that, that was a pro, having Adam and Cameron there uh, helping me out. That, that was one of the biggest things because, you know, it's such a stressful time and you're working so hard and then when you've got to your brothers who are out there, you know, working almost just as hard uh, for you. That just means a lot. We, we're each other's best friends. I know it's cliche, like, oh, my, my sister, she's my best friend, but literally we are, we're best friends. So it'll be hard to separate our, when we go on, to, on our ways, but right now I'm just happy that we're all together. I know our <laughs> yeah. mom's happy because we're, we're the first, her, her first. So we also have a little brother who's 11. So when we all leave, she's gonna be alone with him, so. We'll stay with her as long as we can. <laughs>